and today we had a very 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 successful goodwill haul definitely profits to be made and we are ready to share that with you stay tuned check it out <laughs> Sometimes these will work with parts if they're not too trashed up. This one actually looks pretty good. Nineteen eighty-six, so legit. Couple little poly pockets for a lot. Going. LOL body. Missing my head, but I'm sure I have replacements. Little people. These are a must for me. See something like this, I don't know what it is. Battery operated. It'll be cheaper. I just don't know what it is. So we we'll test it out and look it up. I'm gonna pick them up to make a bundle down the road. These I collect these enough so when I have enough I'll make a little lot. Poly pocket. Lego. Lego my ego. Again, free fun. Maybe. Oh, this is sick. Super sick. That could be in their collection room. Little game room. Game room fine. I could always use these containers. Use those to sort out, sort out different toys. Or when I do a garage sale, I'll that with a bunch of random toys, selling for like 50 cents. 50 cents an action figure, uh, you know, things like that. We're, we're good for that. Rebel 2000. We'll look it up. I don't know much about cameras, but sometimes people will use them for parts, and that's the other part of it. Maybe it doesn't work, and I won't sell it for working, but I'll tell them, like, I just found it. Somebody could use some of these parts to rebuild their scrap or something. Recycle, reuse, folks. That's what we want to do. These ones I do collect if they're in good quality.
this. Oh, let's see. How you doing? So this is the haul for today. Got a bunch of sealed VHS. A couple figures. Peppa Pig. The Woodsies. Vintage Micro Machines. We got a nice little dragon over here. I've got to test out. <clears throat> Toy Story. That one. The little uh, Fix-It Felix. Little me arcade thing we'll have to test that one out too but we've got some vintage fisher price dollhouse accessories little people vintage 80s back there there's a little halloween uh blow up doll uh those are pretty good i think that's a 50 60 dollar unit they're brand new basically in box little edgeware on the box but other than that it's really nice uh, we've got a couple cases we found. They're empty Yu-Gi-Oh! trading cards. But I keep those when I have, you know, again, just doesn't really matter what kind of lots you want to make. You can do a set of four, set of six, set of eight. Uh, but it's better to do it in lots versus just doing one single each, right? Uh, got a couple cases here. These are no games in them. But I do keep the cases because you'll eventually run into the loose disc. So you want to have backups on that. Found a couple cards here, all Disney ones right here. These three. So it's you know a small little lot. A couple bucks. Some Pixar cars. Cars. <laughs> Get to that point in another video. These I call them like cake toppers. They could be cake toppers or just little you know figurines for like a girl's room. Just for display purpose. But once we have enough of those princess, we'll create another little lot. I don't think I have any right now. Poly pockets, but even then, like I said, for what the weight is on these, the little figure turtle. But you know, I'll try to find a couple more and then put that together. Parts mentioned before, parts is great. Uh, this is missing legs, but I think I have some more. And these are the kind that you know you could mash them up, meaning that you could add like a pink arm, you could put another leg on this side. Uh, so you could there you go. So you could just take them all apart like that move the head put a different head on it Can't do it with one hand, but you get the idea and, and you all saw this. This is crazy. It's sealed Well, that was the haul hope you enjoyed it. You know, we I, I cut out a lot of the fluff uh, I'm gonna try it a couple different ways. I'm not sure I I like looking at you know people going through the bins you know a lot in different channels but i know that it can get kind of boring at times and so on this one i just kind of went to the piece parts where i did and my wife did some picking and stuff so i'm gonna test that out i appreciate you guys staying till the end hopefully there was a little bit of value there to you guys um 
you know, it's one picking and watching pickers just go through bins sometimes isn't as much information. We'll so, uh, we'll so anyways, if you found the content was okay, uh, hopefully you'll stick around for a couple more episodes before you decide that, you know, maybe this is something you'd like to follow and, and subscribe to. And if that's the case, awesome. And if anything, this is just something that uh, helps you out. That's what it's all about. Um, if I had one subscriber and I helped them, then I did what I had to do. And uh, I think my wife would attest to that as well. Uh, you know, so she'll be sharing more of the clothing. Today was kind of more of a toy haul. But uh, once we have some, some nice hits and some nice uh, information for you, we'll, we'll give that out and stuff. So thank you again for watching. We'll see you next time.